Hello, I'm Ryo Kuroiwa. This is a joint work with Professor Alex Fukunaga at University of Tokyo. To solve a graph search problem, including classical planning, best first search, BFS for short, is widely used. BFS is a class of algorithms including ASTER, weighted ASTER or WASTER, and greedy best for search, GBFS for short. Previous research has proposed parallel ASTER methods and achieved efficient speed up. However, parallel GBFS methods have some issues. Here, I show an example graph search problem and solve it with GBFS. A solution of a graph search problem is a path from an initial state S0 to a goal state S0. GBFS uses heuristic value of a state or H value of a state which estimate a distance from the state to a goal state. GBFS expands state S with minimum H value. At the beginning, GBFS expands S0. Then we have S1 and S2. GBFS select S2 because S2 has the lower H value. Then we have S1 and S4. GBFS selects S1. Now we have two states S3 and S4 with the same H value. In this situation, the tie-breaking strategy decides which state to expand. In this case, we choose S3. GBFS expands S3, S5, and S3. Find the solution. Previous research has proposed parallel GBFS methods. However, in the experiment, parallel GBFS methods showed pathological behavior. That is, parallel GBFS methods fail to solve some instances which GBFS easily solved. In some instances, parallel GBFS methods expanded more than 1,000 times as many states as GBFS. Inspired by this experimental result, we theoretically analyze parallel BFS method, including parallel GBFS. However, parallel BFS methods are non-deterministic algorithms and difficult to theoretically analyze. Following previous work, we model parallel BFS methods as KBFS, a deterministic such algorithm similar to BFS. KBFS simultaneously expands up to K states. The intuition is K threads or processes simultaneously expands K states at the same time in parallel. Some parallel BFS methods can be modeled as KBFS. In this example, when we have two states S1 and S2, KBFS simultaneously expands two states. As a theoretical result, we found a pathological example where KGBFS can expand arbitrarily more states than GBFS. KGBFS is a GBFS version of KBFS. This example contains more than n states, including S61 to S6n. GBFS expands only six states following the red path. This is because S2 has the H value of 3, and GBFS never enters a region beyond the S2. In contrast, KGBFS with K equal to n or greater less than n expand S1 and S2 simultaneously, then S3 and S4. Now we have S5 and S61 to S6n. Because each S6i has the H value of 1, KGBFS must expand all these states before expanding any other state. As a result, K 
KGBFS expands more than n state in this example. Because n can be arbitrarily large, KGBFS expands arbitrarily more states than GBFS in this example. Note that this example is independent of the tie-breaking strategy. This means that KGBFS with any tie-breaking strategy can expand arbitrarily more states than GBFS with any tie-breaking strategy. Here, we formally define the pathology and t-boundedness. An algorithm A is pathological relative to B if there exists an input where A expands arbitrarily more states than B does. As shown in the previous example, KGBFS is pathological relative to GBFS. A is t-bounded relative to B if for any input, A expands no more than t times as many states as B does. In the paper, we show that parallel weighted A star method and parallel A star method with inconsistent heuristics are pathological relative to sequential BFS. However, interestingly, parallel A star method with a consistent heuristic is k bounded relative to a star. Precisely, k a star with any tie breaking strategy is k bounded relative to a star with the worst case tie breaking strategy. Please read the paper for details. In addition to t boundedness, we propose another type of bound, t b boundedness. A is TB bounded relative to B if A expands only state expanded by B with some tie breaking strategy. A is similar to B in that A never searches a region which B never searches. Parallel BFS methods in the table are not TB bounded. Finally, we propose bounded parallel GBFS method. PGBFSC is a portfolio-based GB parallel GBFS which executes independent GBFS threads in parallel. PGBFSC also uses shared evaluation cache to accelerate the search. PGBFSC is K-bounded and TB-bounded. In another approach, we propose SPUHF, a TB-bounded parallel GBFS. SPUHF expands a state S only if S is proved to be expanded by GBFS with some type breaking strategy. Due to this mechanism, a thread sometimes have to wait another thread in SPUHF. SPUHF utilizes these idling threads for speculative search with the shared evaluation cache. In the experiment, PGPC performs the best, but domain wise does are complementary. In this work, we propose T boundedness, pathology, and TB boundedness measures to compare parallel and sequential BFS. We analyze existing parallel BFS methods theoretically and show that parallel A star with a consistent heuristic is K-bounded, but other parallel BFS methods are pathological relative to sequential BFS methods. Finally, we propose PGBFSC, which is K-bounded and TB-bounded, and SPUHF, which is TB-bounded parallel GBFS. Thank you for listening.